wanted to do is fill a market need. Um, there's a lot of people that need horsepower, but they maybe don't want to spend the money for the bling that we had on our 525. So what we've done is come up with a new engine, a new development, with a bigger cubic inch displacement and 520 horsepower. The 520, I think, would be a real good candidate, uh, especially for our 28. I see this fitting the budget a lot better and us being able to sell that in a 28 a lot easier. That's what got me excited. I just, it seems like it's more of an entry level pricing with the horsepower there. <laughs> Obviously, when you have polished stainless steel headers, that adds quite a bit of bling to an engine compartment, but uh, we took that away from it for the cost savings, number one. But uh, we're still making 520 horsepower, so, uh, and it's got some nice bottom end torque that uh, most of our boating customers need. What a wonderful new motor to put in a brand new build boat or twins or, or so forth. But it's also a great repower opportunity with the millions of 454s and 502s we know in the next 10 years and a decade they're going to be replaced. We don't want to abandon any of our target, uh, our normal customers that are known as performance builders, but we'd also like to open up this market to those that are uh, a little bit heavier, a little bit bigger mid-engine boats. Uh, so we'd like to open up the market to a lot of different people that could really benefit from the added cubic inch torque uh, that that makes and the added horsepower. I think this is an excellent move on uh, Mercury's part. Uh, we need something in between the uh, 496 uh, HO, between that and the 525 uh, from a pricing structure and a marketing structure. I think that that 520 is just the answer to what we've been talking about. I've built actually hundreds of boats uh, with motors like this, the 500 Merc Cruise and the 525. And this is a real, real big value for a small, small price for what they offer. And in addition to that, it has digital throttle shifting and got cast headers. It's going to be a, a great trouble-free, bulletproof engine at a great price. This engine is qualified for a two-year recreational warranty. Uh, that's, a, that's a departure from what we've done, but we've tried to stretch the envelope as best we can on warranties. Uh, we've got all of our product line, all the way up to a 1350, covers a one-year factory warranty for recreational use. This engine actually has a two-year factory warranty for recreational use.